it was part of the routine uh, 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 routine training uh, events that were taking place in the area that were meant to address the combat readiness of our troops. So combat readiness is, is going into people's homes and insisting that they pack up and leave within three hours? That's very much interesting. Military training encompasses rural training as well as urban training. When you do urban training, there must be people. You confront people. But you went in there without a court order. We did not need a court order because we're not evicting people. We showed him our visual evidence. You stay in a military base, you have less than three hours to get out of this house. He questioned the video's authenticity. It may amount to, say, a setup. Cameras were placed to lay the military into the house to videoize this uh, and so on. I cannot go into that. You think it was a setup? It is a setup. Your staff were caught on camera doing something they should not have been doing. And now you're trying to make it sound like a conspiracy when actually the video clearly shows them acting above and beyond their mandate. They're breaking the law. And that has been caught on camera. That's your version. You've got the right to put it that way. But according to me, it's not that way. Actually, there's in a violation of, 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 um, um, of, of, of what now? Of practices. You cannot just take videos that are detrimental to an organization without agreeing with the organization to take that. The organization should not break the law.